Jordan, and I want to show you how to do this this um, DNA stitch. And when you do this, you're going to need four pieces of string. You're going to need two solid colors, so like one of these, a solid color, green, red, whatever. And then you're going to need two clear, kind of clear colors, oh, like this clear green, you can kind of like see through it or this clear blue that you can see through it. And I chose the blue for mine, and I chose red. So, you're gonna, the four pieces you're going to need, you're going to need three that are the same, the same size Ooh. and length, and then one that is much longer. Black. So you're going to take the solid color, one of the solid colors, and you're going to find the center of it, and put it on your finger like this. So you're going to take the back and just go around it like that. Bobby, Bobby. So it would be look like that. Then you're going to take the clear one and you're going to do the same thing. Find the center of it and just wrap it around your finger. And then you're going to want to take the next solid color and do the same thing. Okay, so now that you have Dad, that on, you want to take this, the longer piece, and just slide it through all the strings underneath. Then you're going to want to find the center of the small <laughs> piece. <laughs> and then, once you do that, you're going to want to take the long piece and go yeah. under and over the strings. <laughs> under and over the strings. So you're going to go, you're going to actually go over and under the strings. My bad. Over and under. So you're going to go like this. Over, under. Over, under. Over and under. And then pull all the way through. Okay. And then take the other the piece the other piece of the string and go over and under. So take it and go over and under like you did last time. So over, under, over, under, over, and under, and you're going to pull that all the way through like you did with the last one. Okay. Now you should have that, and then you're going to slowly take it off your finger, okay, and you take it off your finger, you're going to find your string, and you're just going to pull it. Okay, so that's what it should look like when you you pulled it together. Okay, so after that, you're gonna have to make it a spiral. So you like if you start it the wall stitch, except if you have to learn the spiral wall stitch, and so it's gonna look like that. So you're gonna have to make it a circle. So what you do is. You have to take this piece and go diagonal to the other side. Then you're going to take this piece and go diagonal to the other side. 
and then hold it there. Then, you're going to take this piece, oh, and you're going to go diagonal to where it's supposed to be going. So take this piece and go to this area. Then take the, the, this one, this one, go over here. Okay. So after you do that, then you're going to take this one and do the same thing. Go over here. And then go over here. Then you're going to do the same thing with this one. Now that you have that, you're going to take the strings that you have, and you're going to pull it. Okay. Pull it tight. Make sure it's not twisted, because that will look messed up at the end. You want to make sure that they're all straight and not twisted up. So that's all I'm looking for right now. It's twist. Okay. I got all of my twists out. Now I'm going to pull. And now that I did that, well, all you got to do now is do that seven more times. So seven more times, do the crisscross and everything, and then when you're done doing it seven times, do the regular one that goes like this. Then it just goes regular. So you'll take that piece and go right across, and take this one go right across, and take this piece go here, that piece go there, that piece go there, that piece go there, this piece go there, and that piece go there. And then you just keep doing it over and over again. And then you have your then you have your DNA stitch. That looks like this. But depending on how long you cut your string, it could be much bigger than this. This was just a tester on my first time and it ended up pretty good, so on your first time it should be just like this, and it should look really good. So, good luck.